Now some unified firefighters are being called heroes tonight. They saved the day for a group of Taylorsville kids and their beloved animals. Good for Utah's Randall Carlisle stopped by John Fremont Elementary to talk with those very happy students. Imagine you're a fifth grader. You love all these animals. You go home Friday night planning to come back Monday to say hi to all of them, but you hear there's a fire and they're all gone. How would you feel? I would have felt pretty sad and probably cried. <laughs> I'd be so sad because, I mean, they're like my own pets. It's like losing a part of my family. It was my worst nightmare. I, I, my kids love these animals and my animals love these kids. But thank goodness it never happened. Yes, a fire hit the portable that houses the living classroom program. There was so much smoke from the electrical blaze that the animals could have died. But unified firefighters rushed to the scene and moved the rabbits, rats, ferrets, chinchillas, birds, and fish safely to another portable. The kids are so grateful. So today it was back to normal, fun, loving, lots of laughing for these junior zookeepers and their teacher, Suzette Wilson. It's showtime. This is Mufasa. It's like 20, 20 hours a day. They're just like people. They're important in your lives. They're kind of just like people. They, they have feelings. A lot of animals are going extinct these days because we're cutting down like their habitats and stuff. And we need to learn how to save them and also how to have them be our companions for the rest of our lives. I'm very happy today. Um, when I found out about it, I was panicked, but the first thing my um, principal said is, Every, everybody's alive, everybody's alive. So that's what I needed to know. So it's definitely a story with a happy ending. The kids have gone home for the day knowing their animals are safe. At John Fremont Elementary, I'm Randall Carlisle with a story that is definitely good for Utah. Yes, it is. And by the way, the Living Classroom program at Fremont Elementary is the only one of its kind in the Granite School District.